for your satellite system we are having different models okay S satellite system means it is a group of models many more rocks are there so we will go for the mechanical model mechanical model means uh, it will take care of the structural part okay so whatever the structure of the satellite that we are going to design whether it can uh, whether it is possible or not whether the structural failure will be there or not so before going for the actual manufacturing we should go for the model and we will put all the parameters we will implement all the parameters and we will see that whether it is able to satisfy its structural strength or not if it is no problem so we will go for the mechanical model then we will go for the thermal model thermal model means say suppose if you are having the satellite satellite is uh, revolving around the earth it may be possible that there may be part of the satellite which may be uh, direct sunlight is falling on it and there may be some part where or uh, when the sunlight directly will not fall okay so it is like you just assume that you are having the earth earth is rotating like the, the, around the sun so when the earth is rotating around the sun when the direct sunlight is falling on the earth that is i will say that there is a there will be having the day daylight is there okay the other part where the sunlight is not falling that is your night okay similar thing is there in case of your satellite also in case of your satellite it may be possible that during some period the sun sun rays may be falling on it okay and it may be possible that during some period on the other part the sun rays may not fall on it okay so if the sun rays is falling on it there will be increase in temperature the area on which or the place where the sun rays are not falling there the temperature will be much more less so in case of the thermal model we will see that whether the electronic parts are there they can be able to function properly between your 0 degrees and 75 degrees see this much heat if the satellite is much more closer to the sun then the temperature will consume the 75 degrees so if the temperature is 75 degrees then whether the electronic parts they are able to function properly or not and say suppose if it is dark sunlight is not falling on it we are considering the zero degree temperature if it is zero degree temperature whether the electronic part they are able to function or not so these these parameters are taken into consideration in case of the thermal model third one is your electrical model if you are going for the electrical model here we will see the electronic equipments the electronic equipment whether they are able to function say uh, here we are using the uh, solar solar cells will be there okay so what we are using we are using the sun sun rays we are using it and we are converting it to electrical signal and that we are using it suppose if the sunlight is not falling on the satellite then also whether the electronic equipment they are able to function or not okay or till what period these electronic equipment can be able to function in the absence of sunlight because in case of the satellite we are using the solar energy solar energy is the source we are using the solar energy we are converting it to electrical energy and that we are using for running of your electronic equipment so all these models we will prepare for the uh, actual manufacturing for satellite and if all these models are satisfied then we will go for the actual manufacturing of the satellite